In this video we're going to look at using the Astro File Manager and I'm going to use it to copy files uh, from an Android tablet onto a Google Drive account but you can use it for moving files between your internal SD card and your external SD card you can move, move or copy files onto OneDrive or, or Dropbox or even uh, onto a Windows Share Okay, so to start with, we open the Astro File Manager by pressing on the icon here on the in the apps. Now, and Android, sorry, Astro uses a uh, concept of locations. Now, it opens in the primary location. The primary location is actually the contents of your internal SD card. Um, that's basically your user space, and you can copy and move files into this user space. There are other locations which you can access with this arrow here and if I just click on that arrow there or press on it, shall I say, and press on locations, I can see all the other locations here. Now I'm going to stay with the primary location and let's just go back to it. So there I'm back in the primary location. I did that just by pressing on that arrow again. Now to change the directories to move to different folders I use this up arrow here. Now I can go further up into the root of the Android file system. Now some file managers don't let you do this. They lock you into the internal SD, got SD card out of security reason. But with the Astro file manager you can actually move up and down the Android file system you can go to the the root of the file system now you should be careful when you're using any file manager like this um, you don't want to go around deleting files that you don't understand and moving files that you don't understand but uh, I will show you how to do it now so let's just move up there and I move again and again and there I'm at the root of the Android file system now um, if you're actually going on to an external XD SD card you'll actually find it under the mount directory under this directory here or should I say folder and if I open that up well, you can see the contents here now I don't have an SD external SD card uh, on this tablet um, but you can see the SD card here, that is the internal SD card, and that is basically the primary what we started off in. So if I open that up, you should see that it looks familiar, it looks up like the start screen we started on, and that is the primary location. Okay, so now to copy files, or to move files, we basically have to first go and select the files so I'm just going to go and select a couple of books from the books folder so here I'm in the books folder now to select a, a, a book or select a file you long press on the file so I'm going to select this one here by long pressing on this now it's selected now you can see the change in color now to select multiple files now I just click on the other files now I, I don't have to long press this time um, you should notice um, a, thing, uh, a number up here change. It doesn't do it when you f press the first one, but it does when you do the second one. So let me highlight the second one. And you can see that's gone to two. And now we can decide what we're going to do with them. We can copy them by clicking here, or, or we can delete them by sending them to the bin or if we click here we can see other options that we can do with them and you can see I can share them I can rename them, I can move them, I can zip them okay what I'm going to do here is I'm going to put them onto Google Drive now to do that um, actually there are several ways of doing that the easiest way of doing that is by using the share option there so I just press on the share 
No, I get the activity choose and I, I choose Google Drive, save to Google Drive. No, because I've got multiple uh, uh, Google accounts on here, it lets me select the accounts by pressing on this little arrow down arrow here. And it lets me select the folder by pressing on this little down arrow. So here are the folders on my Google Drive account. So I can navigate around these uh, the Google Drive account using the arrow here. Um, I'm going to stick to the notes folder I'm going to place it in the notes folder so okay so it's going to go in the notes folder or the, the files are going to go in the notes folder and then I just press on the save to complete the job and there it is there now if I just wanted to move the files between uh, folders on the tablet itself again I'd go through the selection process so let's select this file here again long press on it now it's selected and now what we need to do now is to navigate to the other folder now I'm just going to make life simple for me I'm just going to place it into this folder here so let's open up this folder uh, sorry I missed a step I need to decide what I'm doing so I'm going to copy it so let's click on that icon there okay now I can move to the other folder so let me open the other folder and there's currently nothing in it and you can see it down here you can see it copying one item what you might not be able to see very clearly here is the option to actually paste it this one says cancel and this one says paste and I just press paste and the file gets copied into that directory or into that folder. Okay, that's it. How uh, to use the Astro File Manager to copy, move files, uh, rena rename files on an Android tablet.